Since June 2024, I've trained over 12,672 project management professionals use AI through my LinkedIn learning course. And I've noticed something that keeps coming up. There's a fundamental gap in how most project managers understand and use AI. Even seasoned project managers with decades of experience are missing key concepts that could transform their work overnight. As someone who's been actively using AI in my project management role for the past three years, I wanted to share five game-changing insights that I normally only teach in my courses. These will completely transform how you approach AI in your projects. But first, quick disclaimer, this isn't some theoretical fluff. Everything I'm about to share comes from real experience managing multiple enterprise projects where AI has literally saved hundreds of hours. And stick around until the end because I'll show you exactly how to avoid the biggest mistake I see project managers make when trying to implement AI. And hey, if you're finding yourself excited about implementing AI in your project management work, but want a complete step-by-step -step system, I've just launched my comprehensive AI for project managers course. It's specifically designed to help you cut your workload by 60% using AI without any coding or technical background needed. Now I will leave a link in the description down below if you did want to check that out. But for now, let's dive in to these game changing insights that you can start using today. Takeaway one, the three types of AI tools every project manager needs to know. Let's start with something practical. There are three types of AI tools you'll encounter as a project manager, and knowing the difference is crucial. First, you've got standalone tools. Think ChatGPT, Claude, or Gemini. These are like your Swiss army knives. Great for quick tasks like drafting project briefs or brainstorming risk mitigation strategies. Just last month, for instance, I used Claude to analyze a 50-page requirements document in minutes, something that would have taken me hours manually. Second, there's integrated AI. Now, these are the AI features built right into your project management software. For example, instead of copying and pasting your project timeline into ChatGPT for analysis, you might use Asana's built-in AI to identify resource conflicts or Monday.com's AI to suggest task dependencies. Now, each different platform has different AI integrations at this point. Those were just examples. Finally, there are custom AI solutions. Now, don't let this term intimidate you. Last year, me and my team implemented a custom AI solution that automatically enabled us to write and troubleshoot challenging formulas in Smartsheet in seconds. Now, it's not complicated to use. It just works in the background as and when we need it, making our lives easier. And hence, we've opened this up to others as well. Takeaway two, the context is king principle. Here's something I learned the hard way. AI tools are like new team members who need context. Let me share a quick story that cost me two days of work. I used to ask ChatGPT to help me create project timelines without providing any context about our company's usual approval processes or resource constraints. The output looked great on paper, but it was completely unrealistic for our organization. Now, whenever I use AI, I follow what I call the context is king principle. So instead of just saying, create a project plan for a website launch, I provide the team size and expertise, previous similar project timelines, known constraints and dependencies, company specific approval processes. Now this simple change alone has improved my AI outputs by at least 80% in my experience. Takeaway three, zero shot versus few shot prompting in PM work. This is where it gets interesting. Zero shot prompting is when you ask AI to do something without examples, while few shot prompting includes examples. So as project managers, this is crucial for getting consistent results. For instance, when creating project status reports, I use few shot prompting by showing the AI examples of our best past reports. The difference is night and day. Instead of generic updates, I get reports that match our organization's tone and detail level perfectly from the outset. Takeaway four, 
the chain of thought framework for complex project management tasks. Remember the last time you had to create a complex project charter? It's overwhelming to tackle it all at once. That's where chain of thought prompting comes in. Instead of asking AI to write a project charter, break it down. First, analyze the project requirements. Once you have the output, then you can ask to identify key stakeholders. Once you've got that output, then you can move on to outlining the project objectives and so on and so forth. I used this approach recently for a 2 million digital transformation project and my sponsor said it was the clearest charter they'd ever seen. Takeaway five, understanding AI's limitations in project management. Now this is absolutely crucial. AI is an incredible tool, but it's not a project management replacement. Now, there are lots of different limitations that I've encountered, but these are the three most pertinent that I want to share with you. Firstly, there's a historical data bias. So AI might suggest timelines based on past projects, but it can't account for new organization changes or market conditions. It's trained on past historical data. Secondly, stakeholder management. While AI can help draft communication plans, it can't read the room in a heated steering committee meeting or handle sensitive political situations. Then there is strategic thinking. So AI excels at tactical tasks, but it does struggle with strategic decisions that require understanding of unwritten organizational context. Now here's the mistake I promised to reveal. Many project managers try to use AI as a replacement rather than an enhancement. They throw entire problems at AI and expect perfect solutions. Instead, think of AI as your project coordinator. Use it to draft initial plans that you can refine, generate checklists that you can customize, create first draft communications that you can personalize, analyze data to inform your decisions, and so on. Remember, your value as a project manager isn't the tactical execution, it's in your strategic thinking, your stakeholder management, and ability to navigate complex organizational dynamics. Now, if you found this video helpful, let me know down below in the comments section. If you're struggling with AI, I'd like to hear about that too. And if you found this valuable enough and want to fast track your AI journey, remember, I've got something special for you. My AI for Project Managers course takes everything we discussed today and goes way deeper with over two hours of practical hands-on training. You'll get my complete AI implementation framework, a library of over 50 proven project management specific prompts and lifetime access to all the content and future updates. The best part, it's surprisingly affordable. I've purposefully kept the price low because I believe that every project manager should have access to these career changing skills. So just click the link in the description down below to learn more and you can join thousands of other project managers who are already saving hours every day with AI.